some positive pain instead of pain less. Okay. So, uh, to give a uh, uh, good look at the pain. All right. Okay, that's good. I think everyone did a good job on this. Uh, now we can throw in your questions. Not unless there are no more questions, then I think I'm, I will be very happy. <laughs> Okay, I'm, I'm going uh, to The question mark is, do we have to employ her tomorrow? Uh, that's a good question. But you've got the right attitude already, right? So I hope that you will have an employer tomorrow. <laughs> okay, uh, let's go back to that screen. Does, is anybody interested in Canada? Because if, if no one is interested in Canada, I, I need not discuss Canada. I suppose that everyone here would like to focus on the United States for now and you're all positive that you're going to find an employer in the United States. So let's all stay in the United States, right? Yeah. But Miss Marge. But wait, hold on. Yeah. But I think uh, uh, Miss Paula has something to say mm -hmm. about the United States. Hmm? <laughs> yes, Miss USA, come on. Mm -hmm. Let me introduce Miss Paula here in front. Okay. Any reminder for all of them regarding the, the workforce for now? Um, I was just telling Marian. Marian that um, during the interview, I forgot the name of their applicant. Okay, there you go. I was just telling her like during the interview, like I think like um, employers they want like answer like that are more precise and short and and direct and straightforward. And um, I think it's really like the workforce here for me, like in my opinion, is very competitive. Um, because I've been working, well, I don't have like a full-time job, but I've been working like a part-time, and I have like a few experiences, and um, I just know that um, we just have to, to be aggressive sometimes, because if you're working with like Native Americans or like people who were born here, somewhat you're going to be underestimated but don't lose hope because um, you know better I guess because for me like I've been underestimated because I wasn't born here when I came here I have this big accent especially in school it's really hard so um all right just be strong just do what you can and it'll be it'll be fine and yeah did you have a good question or anything <laughs> I was put on spot, so I don't know okay. what to say. That's good. Sometimes you can be put on spot. Right? <laughs> okay. Now let's go to your questions related to H1B, summarizing H1B, labor cert, green card, and interview. Interviews. Go ahead. Let's turn this off. Before I ask you a question, Ms. Bunyi, who can turn it off? This one, this part. I don't know. Uh, I don't know.